Welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play Temtem. So, it's been a couple of days since I did the last video. Uh, simple reason for that is because um, I've still been sort of suffering the effects of the cold. Um, and I didn't really want for me to be sniffing and coughing all over the place while doing the video. Because that's probably not going to be great viewing. I yeah, It does feel better now. So that's good. Um, it's still there. <coughs> sort of. But, um, you know, it's a lot better than what it was. Okay, so... Where do we need to go now? We need to go this way, do we? Alright then. Ah, there's a healing spot there. Oh, no, I remember. No, I remember. I healed, didn't I? I did an off-screen heal and I should have... Should have got back to where I was. Also, lag. That's fine. Uh, I'm going the wrong way. Yep. Should have done this first, shouldn't I? Oh, well. That's fine. That is alright by me. Okay. So where do we need to go to get to here? Well, the one drop point is there. Let me go there, there, there. There. Not there. Not there either. There, 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 there. Okay. Okay, I've got it. I know what to do. I know where to go. I could go that way, but that would be ridiculous and stupid. Let's go this way instead. Because I believe this is the right way. Ah, a <laughs> Guzma, I remember you. Kazuma? Kazuma, I think. I'm getting it wrong. Alright, do you know what? Let's go and have a battle first. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. What the hell are you? Zephyrath. You're new! Don't really... Oh, no. Sorry, uh, Asuchi, you're new. Zephyrath, we've already seen. But Azuchi, you are new, you are. Okay. Windburst, okay. Please don't tell me this thing's, like, really weak to this. It's not. All right. Multiple pecs. Ah, yes. Just not the single peck. Multiple ones. Novice punch. All right. Oh, it's got brawny. That's interesting. That's very interesting. I'm going to catch this thing. I don't know what it is. I don't know what type it is. It looks crystal type, but it looks like it probably mixed with something else. I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Azuchi's been caught. It's just Earth type. Okay. It does have brawny. It's got uh, good SVs in health, attack, special defense. That's probably good. Its defense is quite okay. Its special attack, stamina, and speed, though, could leave a lot to be desired. Uh, to be de desired, you could say. Do you know what? Just for that, you should be resired. There you go. My cock up in in English is your now is now your name. Also, yeah, get out of here, Zephyr. <coughs> okay, all right. I should really drink some water, shouldn't I? Always keep yourself hydrated. And this, oh, a couple paharax. Interesting. Okay, well, I do have an electric attack. Jeez, he sounds... He sounds so bad, doesn't he? Just grounding. Alright, I mean, I guess I go for the head ram on Paharak. Just try and kill it. It's not gonna work. Oh, it's got camaraderie. Alright, Feather Gatling. That's an interesting play. Double Feather Gatling. That is very interesting. Unfortunately, grounding just pretty much walls the... Walls you completely. Okay. I'll go for another peck then, but this time on this Paharak. I'm gonna go for the Electric Storm. Sod both of you. Peck to you. Now here comes my electrical storm. Sod both of you. Nice. Gets rid of one of them. The other one's going to die quite soon. Inductor activates as well. I need a one. I need I need a no charge attack. Okay, you're dead. You've died as well. I need a no charge electric attack to really make use of inductor. Anyway, we're never going to be going back this way, so I might as well. I'm still using a lower line. That's interesting. Oh, battle. Hello. Ah, friendly face at last. Well met, Buana. I'm Tanisha, and this is Wanga. Well met, Mastrath. How do you know my name? We got word from Vumbi via my trusty Zephyrath. Not the fastest flyer, but it gets the job done. Good to see you, comrades, I guess. And see you too. How goes your mission? I was supposed to ask, Tanisha. Oh, yes, it's true. Need to know and all that. Apologies, it's just... We've been out here for so long. We've only seen each other for company that... What's so awful about my company, dear? 
Well, your dad jokes get a bit old after the 20th time, to be honest. Oh, my manager at work uh, could... Well, the manager of one of the other divisions um, on the account. Uh, yeah, could, I think the majority of the people who work there could probably very much agree. He does dad jokes every day. Like, one, one a day. They were fine about four months ago. Anyway, stop being honest. Yeah, what do you do here? We spy on the El Soto. Gather information about their movements, and then relay it to the dojo. Not much going on lately. They land a bunch of troops here and further to the west. But they haven't moved much. We think it's because they lack proper rock hopping equipment. A major strategic oversight, if you ask me. So they're trapped there until they find a way to take uh, Upinzani. Upinzani, sorry, that was it. Which we hope they never do. Enough of the depressing talk, man. Hey, let's do something useful. Tempt him up, Mastrath. We need to keep combat ready at all times. Well, one of you one of you has a Zephyr rough, so that's probably not very good for you. Oh! Alright, that thing we literally just caught evolves into a four-armed thing. Okay. Also, you do have a Terry, so, you know, you're great in my book. Alright. Sensei. Oh! Upper, uppercut. It's Earth and Melee? That's interesting. That's not Stoneball. Ow. Thank you. Alright, that's interesting. Turns like a melee? Gra uh, Earth and melee type? Very interesting. Let's go for the electric storm then. I know it's going to do me some damage, but Induct is going to be able to get it back for us. Which would be quite nice. Oh god. Oh, never mind. Grounding has died to Osukai. Oh no. Fierce claw. No! Alright, I mean, I guess I'll bring a Kalps in. Why not? Snarf would have been the better option, obviously. But, you know, ah well. Okay. Actually, no! No, you are a good option, because I keep forgetting. Ah, damn, you lived. I can just lower your, st I can just lower your attack with a burn. Ow! Petrify. Oh, no. Oh, you're trapped. That's not good. You've damaged yourself through overexertion, though, and burn. It's quite good for me. Okay, a peck to Taturi to kill it. I mean, I need to keep going for the attack on Osukai, really, don't I? So let's try and get another burn off. Taturi is dead. It's a tough old battle, this, so far. Embers! Yes, take more burn. You need to get some rest. Unfortunately, will it be enough for you to survive? Kakalp's up to 52. All right. A Valash. Yeah, definitely would have been good to have um, a uh, certain someone in here. That's fine. We can uh, we can get them at some point. That's okay. Oh, Crystal Spikes. No oh, God. No, Grandpa! Windburst the Osukai. Kill it! All right, because I know this is going to damage me through overexertion, which means they both are going to be, which is great. But Valash, you are part Crystal type, which means you are weak. To the form of fire. Okay. I'm no longer trapped. You're no longer burnt. Red Rookie's up to 59. A Volfi. Oh, that thing. Okay. Well, I'm going to rest with both my guys. That that probably means that they're both going to die. Um, okay. This will bite. Are you hitting? You're hitting. Red Rookie. That's an interesting play. That's a very interesting play. Okay. I mean, yeah, you got Scavenger, but you've also damaged yourself through overexertion, which is dumb. Because I could just bring Snarf in now and punch you in the face. Finish you off once and for all. In fact, I'm going to do that. I'm going to hit the Volfi first. So on both of you. Nice. You have been defeated. Scavenger does activate. That's fine. Embers will finish you off. Kakalps is going to take some damage here. That is hopefully okay. Yep, we're good. No wonder the Dojo Master sent you on a solo mission. Those moves are something to behold. Stop flattering him, man. You're just rusty. Thanks, I guess. I'm going to take this item. Two full restores. That's quite nice. Unfortunately, we don't have any sort of rock climbing gloves to sort that out. That's a bit of a shame, but oh well. Moving onwards. Ooh. No! I want more for my sticker album. There we go. We got a towel -y. A damaged Tauli, of course we do. 
Not as cute as Rowlet, I'm afraid, but you know, oh well. Okay, Parak and another Asushi. Asuchi, I think. Asuchi. Right. I mean, yeah, we'll go for a water blade, and I guess I'll punch the Paharak in the face. Punch! Nice. <coughs> Good there for Snuff. And William finishes off the other one. Nicely played, you two. Nicely played. Love the way that w I've been at the same level, but William still gains all like more on its experience bar. It's play nuts, that is. Do you know what? I'm actually going to go this way. This is an area we can use our crystal skates here. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. I lost my crystal skates. All right, we got to come back and get that at some point then. I wonder if I was supposed to get it in the Badlands. I don't know, really. Not too sure. Uh, it's this way we need to go. Okay, then we go this way. Whoop! Straight over. Aha! Someone else also has um, Platinus as well. It is not just me after all. Uh, where do we go now? Let's go up, see if there's anything here. Nope. All right, then. Waste of an area, that. Oh, well, we found some Bel Soto. Ah, uh, terrorist! What? Didn't you guys just crash the narwhal? Surely that's the, the definition of terrorism, isn't it? You deluded fools. Right, uppercutted to your Calibus. There's a toxic skin, that's annoying. Noxious bomb though on the carny. Told you, buddy. Take damage. Colossity, that's mm, fine. Stop trying to humiliate William, you sod. Stop it. Snarf taking poison damage, that's fine. Right, let's, sod it. let's go for the tsunami. And I guess I'll go for another punch. On you. Speed arrows in favor of you. Well, that's not good for me. Oh, God. Allergic spread. That didn't do too much. Damage yourself through overexertion. That's brilliant. Here comes the tsunami. Gives me one stamina left. That's quite nice. Jeez, that did not do much. High pressure water. Ow. Snarf is, snarf is hurting a bit from that. All right. I mean, I could go for a water blade here. But that's a silly idea. I'm gonna punch the carny. Get rid of it. So then just maybe Snarf will actually survive this next attack. That'd be quite nice. Aha! There we go. Now we can go for the finish. On you! There you go. No! Stop with the toxic skin, buddy. Stop it. Snarf can't be taking those hits. No, 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 no. What am I going to tell Sarge now? Tell him you failed by panicking. Too much panicking for you. All right, I'll grab this. It's a married Temdo. Damaged, of course. Okay. And we've got a bit of an area here, but we can't go that way, so we have to go this way. All right. Ooh, another Bel Soto. Hello. Caught one. You're stranded, according to your name. You've caught nothing, mate. Nothing. Okay. William and Snarf. It's up to you, it's up to you uh, these ones. I mean, Snarf is about to die from poison, which sucks. But we're going to try and get as much damage on that Typhoon as possible. Decent damage on Guzma there. Chain Lightning. You're an idiot. Why would you even do that? Yep, Snarf died. Why would you even do the chain lightning that way? That makes no sense. Terry's in now. Terry don't like you very much. Okay, let's... Uh, do you know what? If you want to do that again, I am perfectly fine with you doing that again. Go on. Do it again. Do it again, you fool. Go on, Gazuma. You know you want to. Ah. Oh, no. He's electric storm instead. I'm an idiot. William! Ow. Oh well. <laughs> Looks like Terry's getting all the experience. Not like Terry's the next Temtem that I'm probably not going to be using, is it? Ow oh, well. Alright, Kakaos. Adora Boros. Oh boy. This could be bad. We should both slow now. Right, Ember's on you. Get rid of you. Uh, 
I mean, I could stoneball you. We'll give that a go. Oh, you're still alive, but you are going to die at the end of this turn. Okay. A beta burst on Terry. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's... Wow, I just lost. Wow, all right. I got a bit too overconfident there, didn't I? Wow, okay. I got way too overconfident. Typical, I went through over 40 episodes. Over 40 episodes of not losing, apart from the max. Now I've lost two in the space of like three episodes. This game's getting difficult now. <coughs> That's not a good thing for me. That's not a good thing at all. Also, am I going the wrong way? Yes, I am. Yay. Ah, well, we'll go back and kick that guy's ass now. <laughs> he's, he's buggered now. We shall get our revenge. Just allow me to get over there quickly. And then revenge shall be ours. Uh, what way is it that we needed to go? We needed to go... That way. So this way, and then this way. Oh, no, that guy's screwed now. He's, 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 got, he's got my gander up, he has. He's screwed. Uh, yeah, we'll go down. Yep. Mr. Definitely Not a Terrorist and thinks that we are one for some reason. Rematch! You sod! How did you not... What did you do to me last time? You didn't do anything to me. You fool! Okay, grounding. You've got a... You've got a... Uh, um, you've got a Gazuma right there. That you're going to murder. Windburst and Typhu. That's not much damage. That's fine. Mud Shower! Take that, Kazuma! Chain lightning! Okay, followed by a cheer up. Again, you made the wrong choice. You made very much the wrong choice there. But oh well. You made the wrong choice. That's just up to you, really. Uh, I'm gonna go in front of the mud shower. No point in using the electric storm just yet. Because knowing Gazuma, he's probably gonna try and use Chain Lightning like an idiot. Nope, he's using Electric Storm again. I gotta keep keep remembering this. Luckily, that does bugger all damage to grounding. Dust Vortex. That's gonna do some damage. Yep. Alright then. Okay, okay. Alright, I get ya, I get ya. Unfortunately, I think you both die this turn. Ooh, DC Beam. Get one last shot off. Unfortunately, grounding's inductor ability is activating. Toxic farewell, I gotta keep remembering that. Head ram on you. There goes Gazuma. Nice. Red Rookie's also dead. That's fine. Grounding gets all this experience. To be honest, Grounding did need it. Level 52 now. Okay, I mean I, I guess I'll bring Kakalps in. See what see what works. Kakalps still needs to evolve. So does um Uh Snarf. Snarf still needs to evolve as well. Alright, demoralize. Get lowered, you bastard. Alright, I mean, I'm, ju I'm just not doing anything with grounding right now. I'm gonna burn you. You're gonna do little damage, hopefully. Will you stop? Will you leave grounding alone? Grounding's done nothing to you so far. How dare you? Go for another one. Okay, burn him some more. Yes. Take that. Go for another beta burst. Alright. That's dumb, you keep trying to hit grounding. That is really stupid. Because now I can just go for sand splatter and a head ram and you die. Hopefully. Hopefully you die. Yep, you die to the sand splatter. Lovely. Vengeance is mine! So I didn't catch one after all. You did, but then for some reason you let me go, like a fisherman or something. I don't know. Oh god, another one of you. Huh? How did you get here? Does everyone have those hook implements but us? Probably, yeah. You got a pig epic. All right. You always got mushuk. So I wish that I had my electric storm available. Unfortunately, I do not. All right. Well, I mean, I guess I'll go for this combo. See if grounding survives. The answer to that is no. <laughs> Damn it. Ah, oh, grounding. Come on, grounding. Who's the new exciting member of this team? 
You don't do it incredibly well right now. To be fair, there's Nor's William, actually. All right, well, Kakalps is up next. I guess we'll bring Kakalps in. There's a tsunami coming your way. And I do need to just kill off that big epic, really, don't I? Just to get rid of it. Tsunami, go! Away! Good damage, at least, to the pig epic, but he's going to go for the tornado in response. Ouch! Alright, William lives it. Pig epic is going to die at the end of the turn. Okay, you're going to punch William, of course. That's fine. Well, Kakaps is going to be getting all this lovely experience from pig epic. I don't actually mind that, to be fair. Level 53 for Kakaups. Lovely. Uh, I mean, yeah, I'm bringing Snarf in, obviously. Snarf's the best choice here. Simply because of potentially evolution purposes. That's the reason Snarf's so good here. Here! You have a punch! Oh, that did bugger all. That's a bit better. That's a bit better. Paralyzing poison, alright. You're poisoning Kakaups for how many turns? Is it four, isn't it? Yeah, four and trap for two. I don't mind that. That is annoying, but I don't really mind that, to be fair. Okay, I mean, I guess I'm just going to go for the Sand Splatter here while I wait. And we'll go for a Tail Strike as well. Get some damage in. A little bit of damage. A little bit of damage. Oh, you're so close to dead. You need to get some rest. I'm going to be taking some more Poison damage. That is fine, because you lose now. Punch! Yes! Your parrier may be good, but my brawny is better. Oh no, kick out. Stop getting poisoned. I report you will burn your... Wow! Alright, calm down. Jeez, you just lost the Temtem battle. It's not like that, you know, I've burnt your house or anything. Don't burn my house, you... You, s you honestly sound like the edgiest, saltiest player of a PvP game I've probably ever met. And some creator made this! Jeez, they are so self-aware. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go for a break here, folks. But in the next episode of Let's Play Temtem, uh, I'm going to go heal up and be back here. Hopefully not mess it up this time around. And we'll carry on to the Geno Gap for the Resistance. I'll see you then!